Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm kind of, like, pissed off right now. Uh, a lot's been going on. Uh, one of the main two that's, like, pissing me off is my car. Uh, it's a lot going on. My muffler, my... Uh, just everything about this car. This car is old. It's rusty. It's time to, it's time to get a new car. And I, and I knew that since last year. It's just that my business... It's like, it's the reason why I don't have a new car yet. Now, I am in a deadline of the way my car is feeling and the way my car is moving. Like, it's becoming unsafe to drive this car. And now, I'm in a situation of like, yo, what do I need to do? So, uh, I got that going on. You know, so, so like, uh, I, like, like I said, like, Next month, no later than July, I got to get a new car because it's because if I don't get a new car in like two months, like I'm going to put myself and whoever is in this car in danger. So uh, I got that going on. Um, What else? So my business. It's not going well as far as like the rental. My box truck. This stupid mechanic. You know what, man? Like, just misinformation with everybody, including me. You know, uh, when I found out that there was an oil leak, I didn't know. Like, when they say oil leak, like, it could be anything. Like, it could be the diesel. It could be. You know, like, there's a hole in the bottom of, like, like, you know, so I blame myself for not being more detailed with the oil leak. Like, like I should have been like, hey, when it's an oil leak, do you mean the engine? Or I ain't get too detailed on it. When I hear oil leak, I'm like, okay. Like, I'm look, I'm looking at it like, if it, if it was super serious, they would say, like, it's an oil leak coming from the engine. Like, you know, like, I got to realize that, like, I got to be descriptive with, with people because people don't always give you the breakdown they only give you little stuff and it's just like all right but um so uh like on monday that just went past i scheduled an appointment to check on the uh check on that situation but this and, and this is what i kind of messed up at because this is the same place that i know don't check on engines but when I contacted to to the appointment, I let them know like, yo, it's an oil leak. It's an oil leak. And the guy was saying like, oh, like, uh, we could do it, la da da da. Now, when I went there on Monday to drop the keys off, I spoke to. Uh, this is a different guy. This is the guy that I wish I would have talked to over the phone, because he was like, oh, we don't work on internationals, but we give it a look. And when he told me that, I should have known right then and there, like, yo, I think I should. <laughs> I don't think it's a good idea to let them, you know, uh, I don't think it's a good idea, you know. But I, I still let them take over it, and they took a long time, and this what happened. But um, what else? Uh, so that happened. Um uh, the next day, which was Tuesday, I kept calling them. I'm like, yo, like, what's going on with the truck? Like, they, they took too long. And it was just like, yo, why couldn't y'all check it yesterday to see what's wrong with it? And then y'all took the next day to let me know that, yo, like, we don't got the tools to work on uh, international. So I had to pay the company that's renting my car uh, uh their driver like hotel because the driver had to had to spend the night so i had to do that i did that on me like i they they ain't asked me i asked them because i felt like it was on me even though like everybody play a part of what happened i deserve more to the blame which is you know it, it is what it is um you know i i i, I just took it to the chin because it's just like at the end of the day I should have made that call when he told me that 
we don't work on internationals, but we give it a look. I should have, I should have looked right then and there to t- call them and was like, "Hey, yo, uh, we're gonna have to find another spot." But um, so yeah, they uh, Tuesday, which was yesterday, they uh, they drove it, and I was and I was scheduling another appointment to see another mechanic in Philly which won't be until Tuesday, next Tuesday. Now, I got a phone call from them this morning let me know that uh, we need to see a mechanic now because uh, the uh, it, it's stuck on gear three. And uh, and I think the only reason why it's stuck on gear three is because the, the, the oil, the oil and everything. So, uh, yeah, that's it. And... um. That's kind of putting everything on hold because, like, I still got to pay my uh, business taxes. I still got to pay, uh, you know, I got, you know, I got, I got to pay rent and everything. I was supposed to try to look at a house to invest. I might have to put that on hold. I got to put a lot of things on hold uh, because of my uh, getting a new car and my rental car business and it's just that i would pose a buy a, a truck trailer like it's just like a, a lot's been going on i'm frustrated i don't know what to do i'm just like woo silent i'm just gonna relax sleep on it you know uh this week like friday or saturday i'm gonna go to one of these banks well I, i'm actually gonna go to my uh credit union to see if I could get an auto loan. Well, I can't. Damn, man. No, 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 no. You know what? I'm going uh, to use my business account to get a, a loan to get an auto, a commercial auto loan. Like, it's going to be, it's going to be for, for my car, but it's going to be for my business. So, I'm going to do that and still do the, you mean, I, 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 I'm going to figure it out. That's all I can do. I, I, I'm going I'm to figure it out. It's just... <sighs> the worst thing that could have happened was my car and my the engine being leaked and going to the wrong fucking mechanic. That's the worst thing that could have happened. But it happened. It fucking happened. And, uh, I can't control it. I can only try to fix it, which uh, they said they're going to find a mechanic in Michigan, an international dealership mechanic. So uh, we'll see, man. This shit sucks. This shit fucking sucks. But uh, y'all take care, man.